no sick person today already then. Tamara, this is urgent. You need to come with me now. Oh, what's going on? I told you from the start that chemists are bad news. To think that those scurry dogs do such a thing. They even hid their failure of failed Ella experiment inside the cave. Outrageous. Well, look who's here. How many other problems did those chemists cause that are yet to be uncovered? Calm down, Matthew. We both know Tamara has nothing to do with this. I know, Meyer, but still, how do you explain this? How could Tamara have found the cave that was used for the owl experiment? Nobody knew about the cave, not even our rangers. So everything we heard about Kim is was true. I was just I just can't believe they came up with an evil scheme like this and then tried to hide it. Tamara, that's not true, is it? Now, are you going are you under secret orders from the Capitol? Explain yourself. Enough, Matthew. Oh, M Mytho. These are baseless accusations. It was me who asked Tamara to look into this. In fact, Tamara is helping us trying to establish the facts of the matter. Ah, Tamara, I'm afraid things are getting rather heated here. How's your investigation going? What? The aloe was actually infected by a con contagious plant fever? So that's why they tried to treat the infected aloe first before the disease could spread. The chemists were actually trying to heal it but had to leave before they could finish the job. Does that mean we were wrong all along? Wait, so why did more aloe keep dying every day? And how do you explain that cave? Why did it have to be buried like that? Matthew, don't you remember the geyser exploding back then? I believe the explosion caused a landslide and blocked the cave entrance. This cave is quite close to the geyser, which is probably why it got blocked off. I can't imagine the chemists were capable of even stealing a cave, uh, cave off, let alone burying it. What did you find inside the cave? Is it true the chemists tried to hide their failure there? There's a commentated spring in a cave that was, that was the Arlo's water source? Interesting. So you mean to say their water source was contaminated and that caused the plant fever? Are we too late then? It's been so long, do you think we still have a chance of getting the plant back? Why are you so willing to help? After all, in theory, this has nothing to do with you. Did you do all this just to restore the chemist's reputation? I believe it's because you already consider yourself a part of Moonberry, don't you? Of course, it's part of Tamara's role as a chemist to help as much as possible. Whether that's restoring people's health or our vegetation. Everyone, now we got to the bottom of this. Will you please help our chemist from now on? Of course, we were in the wrong. We got carried away. I'm just happy this is all cleared up, you know, and relieve y'all really are really a good young lady. <laughs> Can you think of anything in particular we will need to restore this place? I see, you need something to strain the debris the breeze and fix the filter machine with. I can help with that. I'll bring out those latest fishing net as a 
Strainer, matey. I can help clean, too. <laughs> I might be able to help with the machine, but I'll have to look at, uh, look at it first. I don't know where it is, so I need you to guide me. We'll go and get things ready while you check on the filter machine. When you're done, report back to me and we'll start cleaning the cave together. Sounds like a plan. You check the machine first, we'll be waiting for you. Let's do this together. You know, it's kind of bullcrap. Like, in the, sto the story, if you actually manage to get his friendship up, he should have, like, different dialogue. That's what the game should have done. Like, you just basically like, ignored him and didn't even try to talk to him. Then, yeah, he will, like, go out of his way to just, like, just, like, uh, yell, yell at you that you had, you were hiding all along. But when you become his friend and stuff like that, you could <laughs> it should be different dialogue. Oh, the black lotus. Didn't come up yet. Excuse me. Let's see anybody got something. Oh, I keep forgetting about her. I forgot about her. Met those. Mathos wants to meet us at the town hall. We'll see what's going on. So we're gathering here because Mathos summoned us. But the guy who summoned us is late himself. I've known him for a very long time. This isn't like him at all. He's usually very stubborn, but proud. He sees you as his rival. So if he has summoned you here, it must be very a very urgent matter. Yes, I'm worried as well. I know that you two didn't have very uh, have a very good relationship, but I can assure you, he's a very kind man. Mitha, there you are. You're late. Yes, I'm aware of that, but this is urgent. We have an emergency situation. What's happening? Slow down and explain. Kimis, I'm sure you're aware of the mysterious disease I mentioned last time. You remember, right? Turns out I was right all along. I found out that it's already affecting another area. I kept a plant that was showing symptoms in my house and tried to cure it using my knowledge. But unfortunately, my methods seem to have been adequate. It's kind of hard for me to ask this in front of Meyer, but here are my notes. I come up with some recipes, but my potion making skills aren't great. Do you understand what notes are all about? And can you perfect my potion? Sally, I have no choice but to ask for help. Because I don't want this new disease to spread any further. It's for everyone's sake, I... 
So how about it? Do you think you'll be able to handle it? So you're going to do some research on it first. Then you'll be able to make the potion. Excellent. Make it quick. I'm not sure how it works, but I believe in both. You both. Thank you for believing in us, Mayor. Chemist, once you're done, come talk to me again. Hurry. Okay, we got a recipe for him. From him, I said for you. Wait, I could have sworn I had love. What's going on? I guess if I didn't have enough mythical horns. Yeah. I just used them up. Yeah, we have to research this. Ooh, that's a lot of them. either we have the big baby okay oh we can only use the grass things okay look at we got this Don't go to that cave just yet because usually this is like towards the end of the store and I at least want to make people my friend They're close to be friends Samantha must be around here somewhere hope you Let's hope he's planting or watering his plants. Nope, he's not. He's having tea. Do you manage to make the potion? Then let's get, let's go test it quick. Does it work? Yes, yes, it works. Thank goodness we can start spreading a potion around the affected area. Good. I will inform Awesome about this so that he can arrange for it to be distributed. You two have done an excellent job. I thought bringing the chemists from the capital would cause a feud between you. But I was wrong. Thank you. Now, 
since this problem has been solved, I think I should take my leave too. But this is your house, man. Why do you look so surprised? Moonberry finally has a new chemist who can solve their problems. And that chemist is you. Since the traditions of my work are finally dying out, I'll take my leave and move elsewhere. No one needs my old witch doctor knowledge anymore. Well, why are you angry at me? <laughs> you say that my knowledge has guided you? And your potion was inspired by my old methods? Don't flatter me. I won't fall for it. What use is this old knowledge since you have new knowledge to share with the town folk? I don't get it. You, you think old knowledge is the foundation of all knowledge? And you still need guidance? Out of all the townsfolk, you say you need me the most. Okay then, if that's what you want. I guess we can guide and aid each other for the sake of the town. Let's see how it goes. I didn't think you would drag me into even more trouble. <laughs> I really do like his romance. Next to Riders, Riders is like the next one that's like big, big, big. He's big up there. Especially when you confess to him, like, oh, bam. <laughs> We're finished with him. Unless we want to romance him. You can basically, if I don't know if they updated that yet, but before the update, um, you can romance all of them. Go on dates with all of them with no repercussions. Okay, what's the deal? Yeah, let's kill some of the little. Bam bam, bam bam. Doggy, I had to kill a big thing without you, man. Here, here's your big ass meat. Yeah, I love you too, but you need to get, you need to step it up a bit.
Should be like three of them because you know, getting that two and getting the two at a time that's annoying. Now, back off my friend. Back off my cake. I need one of you at least. The rock. Bam, bam. We got five of those. We need five more of the razor things. There's somebody still. Oh, I think it's too late to do hers. Finally, a helping hand. Yes. Now please follow me. I got some complaints from the customers that the temperature of our water is a little bit off. Can you please help me find the cause of this? There is some moss inside the old water heater. This old rubbish. I should replace the entire machine with the parts I brought from the capital. Do you know how to fix it? A potion for dissolving the moss, interesting. But would it be okay considering there is such a old machine? Great. I'll wait for the potion from you until then. Alright, that's what she needs. We can make that tonight, probably, and then give it to her tomorrow. Okay, let's do some fishing. Come on, Max. We need you to pop up, dude. Fish at the same spot. We need to see you some new fish. 
Catch my girl's freaking fish. Forgetting about Nova, my bad. Okay, the mall. Oh my god, look at that. Well, I need to go to that place and start killing stuff. Point to where she lives. So we're just gonna stalk her here. She probably wakes up at eight like the rest of them. Yep. So this is what so this is going to clean my water heater yep let's give it a go let's head to the old machine in my well you're already here hmm i think your potion is dissolving all of it i don't see any more moss inside i've been wondering whether i should replace the machine with the one from the capital or May I just close the little wallets about how I moved to the capital? Well, let's head back to the water's bad house, shall we? Here's your payment. You're doing it for free? How kind of you. Hi, Oval. Oh, been busy lately? We did some maintenance on the water heater. How's the water? I think the water feels more refreshing now. I admit that I rely so much on your water's bathhouse these days. It's really eased my back pain when I have a bath at your place. Thank you so much for taking care of this place, Oval. I'll be definitely coming back here next time. 
Thank you for your visit. Please come again. I never would have thought that some people rely on this old place so much. I didn't think this place was all that important to anyone. Hmm. I should be more grateful for everything I have. Well, thank you for helping me out with my water heater. No problem. I'm sorry if I sometimes cause awkward moments with my poor choice of words. Yeah! What? Money. So he can go get a car and put gas in his car. Where you at? Beacon. No. Okay, hold on. I'll get it going. Guys, if you don't stop here, I'll be right back. <laughs> 